Okay. Um, so, funnily enough, it's the group summon thing today, which I hadn't realized. Um, yeah, which I hadn't realized personally. Um, and then this made me immediately go, oh, wait, let me go check that schedule for the Mystic Rotation, right? Because there was a whole, like, rerunning certain Mystics and whatnot, right? The point, that, that was the point. Um, so here's this. Um, we'll, we'll, I'll go talk about right now who I'm going to choose, and, and I'll do my summons, then afterwards I'll tell you guys what I think is probably the best to choose or what you should go with on this. Because um, what I'm going to go with isn't going to be the same as you, and, and, and to a lot of degree, like, the stuff I'm going to say at the end isn't going to be, like, applicable to everyone, because we all kind of have, you know, where we're going and what we need, right? So keep that in mind. Um, so anyway, so that's that. Um, apparently, so I was going to summon on this, but apparently next week, after this rotation ends, is the uh, Moonlight, the Mystic... Uh, group custom group banner if i'm reading the the uh what's it called if i'm reading the announcement correctly which i don't know where it is anymore um so that that's you know why pull on this when i can pull on that um yeah so that was kind of the point there uh so if that's not the case that's fine because i wanted to save mystic medals anyway like I've been playing a lot with Dilibet lately and, and a few other characters and i've been realizing that like while Calric would be great to have um I'm not exactly hurting for him too much. Again, I haven't played a lot of RTA, so, you know, there's that. Um, but, yeah, so probably just going to skip out on, on him again. As strong as he is, he's not conducive to the way I like to play and, not, and my account specifically. Like I said, if, I, if you want to be competitive, you probably should summon for him, so, you know, it's up to you. But, like, I think, like I said, I'm willing to gamble and say that he's going to be on that, like, custom whatever rotation, so I'm just going to go with that. Is that a good idea? Obviously not, but, you know, I'm just going to do it anyway. Um, yeah, so here we're going to, let's go to drop rate increase target selection. Okay. So all this, so I have, I think, a, a an S Luna, and I have two max limit broken Draco plates, and I have one Draco plate that's not, it's just, it's just by itself, right? It's not limit broken or nothing. So needless to say, I don't need any more of this, so we're going to, we're not, we're going to skip that. I don't really care about the end very much, and Dian's artifact kind of sucks, so whatever. I have a max Landy, and I have a max Landy artifact, so whatever. Uh, this artifact kind of sucks, and Euphine kind of sucks. Um, Seaside Bologna, no, I'm not going to take... I already got a max. Both of these are maxed. Um, I'm probably going to pick Cerise to get more Cerise copies, and I guess more of this, which isn't too bad. <laughs> I really want Fairy Tail to Neighbor. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I might take these two, right? Yeah, I'll probably take these two. Um, I don't need more CC copies. I don't need more Kisei copies. I don't need any of these. Uh, I don't need you. I don't really need you. I mean, I kind of want her, but that's more of a, a want thing and not like a need. Uh, I don't need more of you. Don't need more of you. Nope. Uh, none of these. Uh, these and none of these here. Yeah, and I have to, you have to kind of like think about it twice because like I don't need these units, but do I need their ML units? And no, neither of them. Uh, none of you. I mean, she'd be kind of interesting. Atisa Scepter. Eh. Basar, more of these are pretty good. Um, yeah, none of these. Nope, nobody cares. Uh, none of these. None of these. Uh, probably, so, probably going to take her, her, and, if we're honest, just him for more of his merges. Uh, if not him... Then probably her for more of her merges for when I end up getting uh, Lionheart Shermia. Because I'm going to get her no matter what. Either I'm going to get her in that group group rate banner thing. Or um, I'm going to get her out of the... What's it called? Out of the... Uh, the Mystic Shop or the, the Coin Shop, whatever. I'm going to get her out of the Coin Shop whenever she hits that Coin Shop. Um, so I'm going to get her regardless. I've already got like two or three copies of her. But being able to like max her out would be pretty good, and I like the artifact too. The uh, the coin is pretty nice for uh, certain units. Obviously, not that many units, but we'll we'll think about these two. Um, not you. Uh, maybe the new ML Vivian is coming out, so I might pull some of her, but probably not gonna have any Mystics to get her, so that's kind of a wasted uh, thing. Um, none of you. Yeah, none of these. None of these, um, none of these, none of these, 
Yeah, I have all these. Let's go see. Does not display duplicates. So I don't have him, but I don't really care. I don't have him. I don't care. Good. I don't have any of the characters. Any of these units, they all suck. I don't. I don't have any of them. So I'm happy about that. Okay. So like I said, um, for sure I'm gonna take her because I don't have a max imprinted um, S10A, and uh, yeah, I don't have a max imprint S10A. So you can sort, oh, you can sort by, but you can't just like, okay, I want three heroes and these three artifacts. You have to, they're they're linked. Okay. Um, so we're gonna select you. Like I said, uh, fairy tale tenebri imprints are good, and I also like this artifact. Uh, I've been using it on Zerato. Uh, it's a lot of fun. But yeah. So that's that. Uh, let's go look at. <sighs> the problem is I already have a maxed out uh, artifact for her. So duplicates aren't really helpful, and Cerise duplicates aren't really useful either. So I think I'm just gonna, I really should pull for her though. I'm probably just gonna pull for these two, and you. This is probably a really bad decision, right? Don't, don't like, <laughs> don't nobody take my advice on this. Uh, but like I said, I really like using Violet. I think he's dumb. Uh, I really like using uh, Spectre Schneebria. And I really want ML Shermia, and I want to have her max limit broken by the time I get her. So we're just going to go with these. Um, again, the optimal choice here is probably to take Cerise, so I don't have to use um, unknown slates to slate her. But I'm, as I'm thinking, like, the reason I'm not going with her anymore is because as I'm thinking about it, I'm not going to waste slates on her anyway. Like, her, again, her imprint isn't really, like, it's not that good, right? She gives crit chance, but, like, you, got, you should all, you know... It's kind of good as a glue, like to like patch things up, but you surely already have as much crit chance as you need on your units, because um, she's not always going to be there, right? So that's good to realize. Um, and the effectiveness, while it's good, it's not like game breaking. And um, sorry, I was drinking water. The other thing is, I also getting merges on her would, is kind of useless because I'm not gonna. I don't have the gear for her. I don't like. I can't use her. I, she's she's sitting on the bench because I can't use her. So having more duplicates and stuff isn't gonna help. So you know what? Forget it. I'm just gonna not take her. Um, this is gonna be my my thing. Here it is. Um, open the shop. Okay. Well, let's um. How many do I have? Ah, we'll just drop some. Come on. Wow. I spent too much time on that. Uh, <laughs> on talking about the units. Oh my gosh, this is horrible. I spent too much time talking about the units, and uh, so we're just gonna skip through these really fast. We're gonna go um, ten pulls. Uh, we got garbage. This is also the other thing. This is also really good because I need more uh, powder because I don't have any powder of knowledge. Uh, Adamant shield. Uh, infinity basket. Not too bad. Ooh, let's see what we get here. Uh, nothing. Okay, so I wanted to look at the shop real quick. Just to... Wow, well, we got three of them already. That's crazy. Okay, so... Very interesting. So, I'm probably not gonna... I mean, obviously, I'm not gonna buy this. Don't care. Um, I don't know if I'll... I don't know if I'll burn. Oh, you can I can get this stuff down here, too. Very interesting. Actually, I don't know what I'm gonna use the pity on. Now that I think about it. <laughs> yep, nothing. Oh, we got nothing here. We'll stop at 100 and then we'll think about what like, what we could pity. Wow, that was nothing. Come on, give me like a super good like rotation where like I get more than one in, in, in one batch. Oh, that's horrible. Uh, these are really garbage. Um, come on, come on, give me something good. Uh, there's that. Ugh. Um, ah, that's kind of sad. Uh, is there a pity here? Or is this, this is our pity, right? There's no, I can't get a, a pity here and then here, right? That's not, this is our pity. So, how much, I have 300 left. Really, the main thing I want is, I guess, another 10 merge. I really want this, another merge of this, but I'm just going to go for Spectre Tenebria merge here. Um, yeah, you know, it'd be nice if we got uh, something else, but we'll, we'll just go with this. Yeah. Uh, 
120, okay. So, so theoretically, these are supposed to be more optimal, right? You got more chances to just get something, but uh, I got kind of baited into pulling for Spectre to uh, Fairytale to Nebria Merge, which is not a good thing, but, you know, it is what it is. We'll live and learn. Um, like I said, all, this is basically a fun banner just because I have all this stuff anyway. Um, yeah, so we're just going to pull a copy of, of Fairytale to Nebria. Why not? Oh, okay. I'll have to go fix that then. I'll be right back. Okay, I'll say like I said, I, I probably used up all my luck on those um, moonlight tickets or whatever, because like I said, ideally the, the the point is that you're supposed to like, you know, all right, I did a ten pull or a twenty, I, I pulled twenty units and then I pulled a violet or something, right? The idea is you're supposed to pull a violet and those those medals up there, these coins, you still gain them. Can you see my cursor? What the? Oh, there we go. So let's say you pull 20 and then you get a violet. You have 20 medals still, so you can, you know, your pity is supposed to be there. But um, obviously it didn't work out that way. Uh, for those of you, again, if you're new, uh, this is actually, you know, this is there's no way to lose at this. You're just going to have to pity a unit. And if you don't, if you get more than, you know, a pity, then, you know, good for you. If not, you'll get, you know, two or whatever. Um, and because there's three, you can get different ones, right? Uh, but like I said, for me, all the units on this are like... Oh, I should have. Ooh, I should not have done that. Oof. Now I have to go. No, I can't. Oh well, whatever. That's fine. Um, I was gonna talk about like what you could get, but I guess not. Uh, so yeah. Again, don't don't be afraid to pull on this banner. Uh, I got baited because I already have everything. Um, but you, you know, unless you have everything, you really can't get baited into that. Um, let's go give her a memory imprint. Look at that, two Tenebrias. Right, let's go back here. Let's look at our attack stat. Uh, 3,500. So it should be like a 33, 3530 or something like that. After this imprint, we'll find out. Let's see. Level one. Yep, okay. Uh, 3540. That's not bad. Um, but yeah, so. Let's go back to the summoning here for a second. Like I said, ideally, you should have gotten one on the way, and they're in your like. It's better than regular pity because if you go twenty summons into pity, right? Um, you went twenty in, and then you got the unit, and then the pity resets, so it's another one twenty to get another one. We're here because of these coins. You go one twenty, you go twenty in, get a summon, get a, one of the things on the banner, or whatever, right? One of these five stars. And you can keep going, right? And you still have those 20 stocked for the pity. So that's kind of the, like, um, that's kind of the point of this banner. Um, so you can't really lose. In terms of, like, what I think you should pull, I think, funnily enough, all the limited units are kind of ass. Like, I don't know what you want me to tell you. Like, they just kind of suck. Um, they don't, like, they're not inherently bad. But right now, they're not very good. Um... So again, we can go back through, like, Spectre Shinibia sucks because Ran and um, Pieria are, you know, why use her when you can use them? Um, Cerise is still pretty good, but nobody wants to invest the gear into Cerise. They, ought, they would rather put it into um, Moonlight uh, Conquer Lilius, which isn't a bad choice because she's that much strong. She's that much stronger or, like, she's that strong or that much stronger. I wouldn't necessarily agree that she's stronger than... than than her, than, uh, what's her name, than Cerise, but she is very strong, and right now she's the flavor of the month, so people would rather have their gear on her, and, you know, she does the same thing that, um, you know, a Cerise might do, so you're not gonna double dip like that, um, but yeah, I think Cerise is still pretty strong, uh, especially that artifact, for those of you who don't have a max artifact, that you probably put that, so that, that's probably a good one to choose, Landy absolutely needs to be on that banner, if you don't have a Landy, um, pull for Landy, um, obviously, Dien and um, Dien is isn't very good anymore. She got buffed. Now she cleanses two with her S two, which is like whatever. Who cares? Um, but she's she's still kind of whatever. Uh, the only thing that's good out of the Luna one is the Draco plate. Um, so you know, for for newer players, probably like the Draco plate is good with the Landy and the Cerise because they're all limited so you want to focus on limiteds more so if you have all the limiteds then you can just pick whatever you want honestly pick whatever you're missing fill out your hero journal uh pick whatever you want merges of you know whatever but you know those are the those are the priorities landy 
Cerise and Draco Plate. Not even Luna. Luna, I mean, no one cares about Luna, but Draco Plate is a very good artifact. Um, yeah, and everything else that's not limited is going to come back eventually, so, you know, whatever. Like, I was going to put LQC on there, but I could just pull on the... I was going to put LQC. I was going to put regular Charlotte on there, but I could just, you know, Charlotte's right here. I could just pull for her if I needed to. Uh, this is pretty good. I actually need, you know, who doesn't need more uh, Elbrus's, uh 20%. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, ideally you just fill up with limited stuff because it doesn't always come back. Uh, the problem is like the real, like the limited units aren't limited anymore, right? Nobody cares about the limited units. The limited units are the collab units, which are real limited units. So you've got things like Ram, things like um, Amelia, things like uh, Milam, things like, uh, what's his name? What's her name? Uh, the girl, the, the slime. Ramiro, I keep forgetting her name for some reason, I don't know why. But Ramiro, like... All those are, like, way, way easier to, like, work on. Um, they're just a lot better, is the bottom line. Um, and you can't get them out of this, so, you know, whatever. Um, sadly, the Guilty Gear collab is kind of, like, dumpstered on. Like, all their units suck these days. Like, you can't use anything. Like, you can't even use Dizzy anymore. Um, theoretically, you can use, like, some people are still trying to use Elfelt. Don't use Elfelt. Some people are trying to use Jacko. I am using Jacko because I think she's fun. Let's go look over here just as an added sort of tacked on thing. So this is my Jacko. Um, she sucks because, uh, for one, this helmet's not maxed and this isn't maxed either. And like, you know, her gear is kind of all over the place. But um, theoretically, I want her to have like, you know, 190 speed, almost 200 speed at the end of the day. 200 speed would be pretty decent for me uh, with this rage set. And. Yeah, I think she'd be pretty decent like that. Um, she needs to get... I would probably pair her with, like, a Cerise. So have Cerise in the back um, getting her passive, her S2 thing. So when Cerise strips, 25% chance to stun on top of that. Obviously, this isn't maxed out either, right? I'm missing all kinds of stuff. Um, have a 25% chance to, to... or Have a 100% chance to strip, and then a 25% chance to stun. Um, and then if she stuns, every, everyone moves up by 16%, right? Or 20% at the end. And then hopefully she gets to go uh, just completely dumpster somebody with this S3. Because not only are they um, debuffed, so this goes off. Uh, they're debuffed, and then this goes off. And you penetrate defense by 50%. And you get an attack buff. And all those multipliers get multiplied by this. Because this isn't um, attack increase. It's not like you get 12% extra attack. No, this is raw damage. So this is a multiplier that adds at the end. It should theoretically add at the end like that, but I don't know how their math works, and we haven't, like, we're not able to test this very well, so, like, you know, <laughs> we're kind of stuck with what we are. Uh, and then, uh, if she, when she kills somebody, she should kill somebody. If she's not killing people, then, uh, you know, she's worthless. But when she kills somebody, everybody moves up by another 10%, so that's 30% in total. Theoretically, that's kind of what you want to happen. Uh, is that going to happen? Probably not. You're going to get constantly. Um, she's not going to do anything, and, you know, whatever, so... Uh, that's that. Um, again, the problem is that Jacko does, like, all this roundabout stuff to basically just do what, like, Hua Young does without even breaking a sweat. Like, Hua Young just, she's just too strong compared to, like, what this is. Like, it was weird that they made her a fire warrior when Hua Young came out literally, like, in the same breath. While they were talking about Jacko, Hua, somebody was like, Hua Young, like, out of the side of their mouth. <coughs> um, and she made her irrelevant, right? So, it is what it is. I would have liked the Hua Young merge out of that uh, triple banner or whatever, but... I didn't show her off in the Guild War. I was supposed to show her off, but this is her build right now. Uh, her HP is a little higher than I'd like it to be. Uh, you can, you know... Getting her HP as low as possible is basically what her HP should be, right? Um, you don't want it to get it at zero, basically... No, well, not zero, right? Um, the minimum. You don't want to get it to the minimum, just get it low, right? There's a difference there. Some people want to get it super, like, all the way to the minimum, and that's not really helping you. Um, but I think getting it low is pretty decent. The other thing is, you probably want speed. Um, mine isn't that fast, but if I try to make her fast, I lose a lot of stats. Let's just go with this. So, this is probably the fastest I can make her, and she's only 228. Today, I fought a, a Hua Young that's still one-shot, like... Hit me for like what, seventeen thousand damage with two hundred and fifty speed. So like, honestly, you know, <laughs> you just 
<laughs> you're just gonna die. Like, there's really no, you know, if ands, or buts about it. Like, and it's hilarious just how outgeared you can be because with this much attack, like, attack, attack, and attack, obviously these two are missing 10%, like, 5 and 5. Um, but with this much, I still barely kill, you know, I still barely dropping, like, I don't know, 17, almost 1800 damage, 18,000 damage, almost. Um, and they're they're doing that damage with speed set with 250 speed like that's insane that's yeah I don't know that's crazy but um, yeah so like I said uh, I, that was just kind of a tangent the um, talking about the guilty gear collab units are kind of ass compared to like you know rem and all that stuff but yeah so like I said this uh, hopefully you guys get a better look out of this like I said I think I used up all my luck when I got those uh, moonlight tickets but you know it is what it is. Um, yeah, next time we'll see each other um, probably in the summoning realm. It's probably going to be uh, during the you know the week after next week or next week when they're doing the Mystic rotation banner. And we'll 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 probably take we'll take Calric, we'll take um, ML Shermia, and Conquer Lilius. Those will be the main three that I'm taking, and then uh, from there we'll pull. I don't know how that system is going to work exactly. Um. Yeah, I don't know how that system works, so, you know, I don't know if it's going to be coins and whatnot, or if it's just going to be like this. Hopefully this carries over, I'm not sure, I mean, that'd be pretty cool, but, you know, what it is, what it is. Do I even have, how much do I have? 25 summons, right? 5 times 5, so 50 summons, I have 50 summons, so I have enough for pity, that's cool. Uh, yeah, I don't know how this is going to work, yeah, I'm kind of confused about that. Um, otherwise... I think you get to choose the four stars as well, uh, which is pretty cool because then I get to choose Rowana. No, what's her name? Kawana, ML Kawana, Bad Cat Armin. What was the other four star? There was another four star I was missing here. Well, I'm missing quite a few of them. I just like the other ones I don't really care about. Um, how do I all heroes? Uh, four star, light and dark. Yeah, I want these two. Oh, those are the only two I'm missing. Okay, well, I guess I have them all. Yeah, I'll put them two, and uh, you know we'll be solid. Um, is there any other? Yeah, there's like no other. Like the problem, the, the thing I was thinking was like, yeah, there's no other like ML unit I need copies of every. Oh, actually, cause you, I think you can pick three, right? Three, three ML fives and three ML fours. Unless, unless the next one coming up is a pick whatever unit you want. Where it's one, right? Run one and one. If it's that, if that's the case, then that's gonna be different. Um, but if it's three and three, the same way it is here. Actually, now that I think about it, it's probably just gonna be one and one. You get to pick your five star, you pick your four star, and then have at it. Um, but if if it's three and three, it's gonna be them two. It's gonna be these two. Damn, a little die. Uh, it's gonna be these two and uh, Guider Ether, just because again, Guider Ether is good for transmit stones. <laughs> I'm short on transmit stones these days. Well, I'm not short. My box is full, but whatever. Um, yeah, I should have cut this video out a long time ago, but anyway, that was that was that. Um, good luck on your guys' polls. Uh, obviously, this is not a very good banner. Don't copy mine. Um, please, please don't copy mine. <laughs> um, but yeah, until next time.